What's up everybody, Painty's Comics back with a, another contest video for you today. Uh, this one's for my boy Eddie the Comic Guy. A uh, really cool guy, he's the uh, one that started the um, Community Matters poster, which I'm sure you've probably seen. Uh, he makes great videos, does a lot of cool uh, random act of kindness. Uh, he's really crafty, uh, really good at art. Uh, if you've seen any of his videos, uh, you'll know that, or if you've seen any of the uh, random act of kindness videos that people have put out. Uh, from Eddie, then uh, you'll see that. Obviously, uh, he's really good with his hands. He's just recovered from uh, an injury to uh, one of his hands, so uh, so he's able to do all of his arty stuff that he likes to do, which is really cool. Um, and you know, like I said, uh, this is uh, his hundred subscriber uh, contest. And what he wanted us to do was show either our favourite Batman or Superman story arc. As you may know from my. Uh, Tim Moran contest entry. Um, I haven't read many Superman books, and the one that I have read, um, well, it was shit. So obviously I'm not going to pick a Superman book. Uh, so obviously mine's going to be Batman. Um, I know a lot of people will be picking stuff like The Killing Joke, Dark Knight Returns. I'm sure Big East Comics will do Nightfall. But I'm going to go a little bit out of the box. Um, I have read uh, a few Batman stories. Um, a lot of my interaction with Batman is from the movies and the DC animated series and then all the animated movies and a lot of the animated movies bring the comic to life so I don't feel the need to uh, read them straight away although I will get to it eventually after I read the millions of other comics that I want to read. Um, so I'm going to go a bit out of the box and I'm sure this is going to be quite controversial or maybe not, you know. Whatever. And I'm picking um, Batman and the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles as my favourite Batman story arc book. Um, it hasn't finished yet, there's still two issues to go. But I absolutely love this series so far. Uh, this is what a crossover team up book should be. The story is fantastic, I love the art, and the covers are great. Is Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles heavy? But there are more of those than there are Batman. But Batman does get his fair share. In this series we see quite a few of Batman's rogues. Uh, we've seen Penguin, Ra's al Ghul, and I'm sure we see many others before the end of this series. The cover for the next issue looks fucking great. Joker's going to be in it. So I'm sure this isn't going to be everyone's first pick. And, uh, you know, if you've got any Batman suggestions for me, uh, you know, leave them in the comment section below. Okay, so the story in this one is the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles have been uh, transported uh, somehow to the DC Universe and they're trying to um, find their way home because the whole time that they're in this universe their cells are degenerating and they're basically turning back into turtles if they stay in the DC Universe for too long. So my boy Batman um, eventually after the first issue teams up with them and decides to help them. Shredder is fucking shit up. He's um, completely tormenting a few of uh, Batman's rogues and uh, yeah I can't wait to see the rest of them unleashed you know please you know, go check out Eddie the Comic Guy if you haven't uh, if not you're doing YouTube wrong because the guy's great he's got something for everyone and he's a really cool dude so yeah that's my pick this is my video thank you very much for watching peace out